Hi, Buttons and Bows, Reborn Nursery here with a box packing video. This box packing is a Reborn Skylar by Kimberly Dolls that I'm selling out of my collection. And she's going to Phyllis Landry, or Land Landry, Landry, I think. Um, so we're going to get this box packing done and then we'll get it loaded to YouTube and y'all be able to see it. So we'll see. So the first thing that I've got is some clothes. And the first thing I got is this little vintage gift set, sweater, socks, and a hat. I'm just going to put that in the bottom of the box. And then we have some clothes, some little outfits. I'm hoping all this fits in the box. So we have a little llama outfit with a hat. And then we have another little llama with a hat and a pair of socks. And then we have a little flowery outfit with a pair of socks, hat, and pants. Then a Mickey Mouse outfit. And I believe all this is newborn. I might have put a, there's also a hat with it because uh, Scarlet is bald. Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse, I'm sorry. Um, all this is newborn. I might add a three month size in here because I do like her clothes to be a little bit bigger. That way you're not stretching on her too much. Then a simple pink onesie with a pair of ruffle bloomers and a hat. I bought a lot of hats for her because she is um, bald. Then we have this little outfit, pair of matching bloomers. Then her original outfit that she was in in her pictures. And there's several pink hats in there, so they'll fit her. Oh, and then her Easter outfit. So one of her pictures got a little hat with the Easter ears. And I just thought of something I forgot. Oh my goodness, what was it? Remember, this is so crazy. Um, hold on, I'm not sure what it was at this point. Uh, oh, her lovey. I have to go get her lovey. So these are the care instructions and her COA from Kimberly Dolls. Now I installed a drinking wet system in her. Um, it works perfectly. Here goes the COA. And uh I've tested it and it's on my YouTube channel and it works. Everything's great. I've got some diapers here. Oh, that's the wrong size. So I've got some newborn diapers here. They've got a cute little panda bear on the back. Or, no, Pooh Bear. That's Pooh Bear. So we're going to just lay those in there. And then this is the bottle for her drinking wet system. And we should only use water, clear water, inside the bottle is her lovey, I mean, I'm sorry, her pacifier, and a clip, and then her, her bottle. Let me run grab that lovey real quick. Sorry, my cat tried to run in here. Here's her little lovey. It's a little beanie, beanie, be, beanie Billy's T.Y. lovey. And then here she is. She just was too heavy for me. So there's absolutely nothing wrong with her. Her eyes 
are removable so that she can be asleep or awake. She has armatures in her arms, so you can pose her arms. And she has uh, no armatures in her feet, although Kimri is doing a doll now with armatures in the legs. Here's her cute little feet. No tears, no, no scratches. I gave her a fresh bath last night and powdered her with this little hat on her head to help cover her. Again, she has no tears or anything. I was gonna show her whole body, but it's hard for me to get her dressed and undressed. So let's get her ready to go. I'm gonna put the hat back on her. And then just because I'm going to go ahead and put a diaper over her head. I don't know if they actually do that with silicone dolls or not, but I don't want to take any chances. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then over her little hands here, we're going to put some little mittens. Protect her little hands while she travels. Then she has this pink blanket with a little bear on it that I'm going to wrap her in. I think she weighs about eight pounds. She's going to go out in the mail Monday on my lunch break at work. goes the bottle and the lovey. I don't really have anything to stuff down on that other side. But maybe some paper. I hope Phyllis enjoys her. I would have loved to have keep her. But like I said, she's just too heavy for me. And I just couldn't see let her, her just sit here and do nothing. All right, so let's get her packed up here. with me. I uh, gave her seven months to pay off the sweet little girl and she did so without fail. So I do offer layaways if anyone's interested in some of the higher price read ones that I sell out of my collection. Although for right now this is uh, the last one I'll be selling for a while. My health has been kind of bad since February. So I've had to sell off a few of my dolls and I haven't been painting much. So hopefully um, I'll get to go back to painting here soon. 
Okay, we got the fragile stickers everywhere. And then we'll put the priority sticker on and I'll fill that out off camera because I'm not sure Phyllis would like to have her uh, address shown on camera. So there she is everyone, very heavy, ready to go Monday morning. I hope Phyllis loves her, enjoys her. Thanks everybody for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to Buttons and Bows Reborn Nursery for future videos.